In more local coverage tonight, Providence's bishop is responding to Pope Francis' new guidelines on family life. The pontiff released the document called The Joy of Love Overnight. And while it doesn't make any radical change to Catholic dogma, the pope is encouraging more tolerance of those with different lifestyles. Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright has Bishop Tobin's response, new at 5. The Diocese of Providence says it's forming a task force within the next few weeks to analyze the Pope's new document. Pope Francis is once again delving into society's most controversial topics. In his latest writing, The Joy of Love, the Holy Father doesn't condone same-sex marriage or divorce, but encourages the Catholic Church to be more accepting of people from all walks of life. The document's unique in that it has a uh, unique ability to um, please and disappoint almost everyone who reads it. Thomas Tobin, the Bishop of Providence, says he's still reading the document. It's more than 200 pages long, covering everything from marriage and intimacy to abortion and contraception. In the short term, I'm not sure that it'll have any noticeable impact. But I think in the long run, it will have a tremendous impact. As I said, it's a blueprint for us going forward. Carl Bissinger from Fall River is a practicing Catholic. His cousin is in a same-sex marriage. He says she hasn't always felt welcome at church. I think at times she's expressed to me her, um, you know, hope that the Catholic Church might change a little bit. And I think, you know, this moves, uh, you know, the church in a direction that she might welcome. The bishop's new task force will spend the next year reading the document and coming up with recommendations for how the diocese exactly. should respond. It'll take a long time to reflect upon this and to understand and, and to accept all the challenges the Holy Father has given us. The bishop says he doesn't know how many people will be on the task force, but he says it'll be made up of people from all walks of life, including singles, married people, and divorcees. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Madeline Wright, Eyewitness News.